In this part of our tutorial, we want to uh, tell you how to add an AutoCAD file and also an image of project to the file. It is possible to um, add a picture, image of the project to the file and work on it. Or uh, add an AutoCAD file with the DWG file type. I will uh, explain this to you. Go to the Insert tab, Import CAD file, Option. So the import is not uh, just our option. We can link the other CAD file. If you think your CAD file change time, change by time, you can use link. It is be much better option. The CAD file, which we changed its configuration, I try to add colors to the invert. So the warm colors um, invert to the cold one and vice versa. And if you use preserve, uh, exact the same colors will add to the, your file. And you can uh, use black and white color. If your colors are highlight, preserve uh, is not good option. Black and white is much better. Layers um, is the our, is our option. Um, use all for all layers, visibles or invis uh, invisibles. And what is your units? Imperial. If uh, you have to make your CAD file unit exactly same as your Revit file and positioning to the origin, to internal origin. And uh, there is an option here, current view only. So you can um, you can't change your view if you select this one. Okay, my file has been added to the Revit. I uncheck this file. Uh, I want to move the file. I select this from the right corner. If this option is available constraint, you can just move a straight. But if you uncheck this, you can change in any directions. Okay, I pin the file here. And I deactivate the pin options. Maybe you have the CAD file before and you want to add uh, make a 3D file. So this is the method uh, which you can import easily uh, your desired CAD file. I don't want to remove it. I just um, hide the file from the view tab, visibility graphics. Um, I go to the import categories and uncheck this checkbox. So um, the file is available but is hidden now. Uh, the layers of the CAD files, um, you can um, make them visible or uh, invisible, okay? Apply. All valves has been hide. The layers of your CAD file so it's possible to hide from here. This is one method. This is one method to add a CAD file to the project. Maybe uh, you have a PDF CAD file. PDF file, I mean. Or for example, the image. For doing this, <clears throat> sorry, you can use import image tool or link image tool. 
um, import image tool and import PDF option um, are available in the 2020 version of the Revit. And link image and PDFs um, have added to the software from the 2020. I mean, 2021. I try to open the file. I try to left click one time and change the size to your desired one. Okay. Um, use approximately um, correct dimension. Maybe it is not perfect, but uh, estimately is good. I try to resize it. Okay, finally. Select it. Okay, pin it. And deactivate the pin type. So um, it's not possible to select it now. And you can do it vice versa. Okay, unpin and delete it. So this is the method of how add the file to your Revit as a CAD or as a as an image and you can add PDF file exact same